Well, this is the third year Comcast has been sponsoring the Mayor's History Makers Awards, and this year is highlighting seven honorees nominated by organizations in Houston who deemed them to be worthy. One of those nominees is here this morning. Happy to welcome Charlotte Kelly Bryant here, nominated by Comerica Bank. And uh, also, she's the founding president of the Blue Triangle Multicultural Association and Misha McClure, who is Comcast External Communications Manager. Good morning to both of you. Good morning. Good morning. And by the way, you really look good. You, you, you said gussied up. You really <laughs> have done it very, very well. How surprised were you when you were told you were not? Oh, I was so, it was absolutely amazing. I thought, history maker, what does that mean? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And what did they tell you it meant, and how do you fit into that? Well, it's amazing how it's just, I was just mentioning to her that you just do things day by day, and when situations come to you, you make a decision one way or the other. Right. Blue Triangle. So why did that come about, and where is it, and what is its role? Well, it has become my passion, but... In middle school, we called it junior high. Our teachers in, in, encouraged us to join a group called the YWCA mm -hmm. Houston. Uh, some years passed uh, earlier, they had invited women of color to join the Houston YWCA, and that was exciting. And we loved it because we got a chance to meet girls across the city mm -hmm. that looked like us. Mm -hmm. And it was so much fun to have meetings. But in those days, we met in houses you see, but we recognized those that didn't look like us did not meet with us. Wow. But we really didn't care at that time because what you have never had, you don't really miss. Right. So that's the, that's the wonderful thing about it. And Blue Triangle still exists today as an association? It does. Okay. It does. As a matter of fact, that's one of the first things we did once we acquired the property was to maintain the name Blue Triangle. It became its name because in the early days when the Black, y, black women of the YWCA could not decide on a single woman's name to call the first branch, which we, we became the first branch of the YWCA. They couldn't decide on a woman's name. They chose the color that was in the regular triangle okay. of both the men and women. Did you notice? I, yeah, I did. I noticed okay. that as well. So it became a blue triangle. And it's still there today doing great work in the community. Yes. I've been over there. You really are focused on teaching yes. kids to swim and do exactly. a lot of different things. Exactly. Misha, talk about Comcast's uh, relationship with all of this and why it's so important for your company to be involved. Definitely. Well, Cambriel, Comcast is committed to giving back to the community. And what better way to do that than to recognize history makers like Charlotte Bryant in the Houston community and um, in celebration of Black History Month because we want people to know all of the great things that Houston people like Charlotte Bryant have done to advance the initiatives of not just African Americans but people in the community as well. So it's very important for us to give back to the communities where we live, work, and play in celebration of history makers like you. It's been seen, and through the years have been some uh, really notice, uh, really honorable people who've been uh, honored. That's kind of like the wrong way to put it, but there have been some good people who've been really been honored in this luncheon every year. Definitely, and it's not just people who have name recognition. Mission. We want to honor those unsung heroes that you might not know about, but they've done such great community work that we want to spotlight those individuals. And how does someone, if they are interested in doing this for next year, how do they get involved in trying to do that? We, uh, we recommend that they follow Houston.Comcast.com, and we also reach out to our nonprofit partners to uh, nominate individuals who have done great things at their nonprofit organization. So you go to the website, and from that point on, they'll get all the information they need. They'll get all of the information they need. Miss Charlotte, it's so good to see you again. And thank you. Uh, thank you so much for what you do in the community. Congratulations. Thank you. You and all the honorees. I, will I have to salute you in a different fashion now that you're an honoree? Not or? at all. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'm still Charlotte. Oh, thank thank <laughs> you very much. Congratulations to you. Thank, thank you. you for what you're doing. Thank you so much, really Cambrell.